Hello guys, welcome back. Today is we're playing Bolton at Port Rose. Now you're gonna to have to bear with me because my voice is very croaky, I'm not feeling great today, but I'm gonna continue with the vlogs. I'm dedicated and hopefully Ipswich can get three points today. Bolton at home. Now there were rumours about Bolton going into administration the other week, but I don't think that's gone ahead. But my prediction for today, I'm gonna to say 2-0 to Ipswich. I think we're gonna to win today and I think we'll keep a clean sheet. Mum, prediction? I am going to say 2-1 to Ipswich. It'll be Paul Hurst's first win of the season. Nice. So yeah, I'm going to go down now. I am on the drag, so I'm going to keep this intro very short. If you do enjoy this video, make sure you smash it a like. Subscribe to my channel if you're new. And yeah, if you haven't watched my Brentford vlog, check that out because I make an announcement with Magical Vegas in that. Um, and yeah, let's go. AJ mate, uh, now going to Ipswich Bolton, what's your score prediction? I'm going to say we're going to get our first win today, so I'm going to say 2-0 town. 2-0? Who's going to score? Matt, I don't know, it doesn't matter, I just need our first win. Right, so I'm here with Scott once again. Did you enjoy last game mate? The second half was really good, yeah. Yeah. Got, they got to play like that again in the, like in the second half. Yeah. Obviously we're playing Bolton today, um, we're still yet to win. Are we going to win today? Oh, definitely. I'm going for 2-0 Ipswich. Two nil win. If they play like they did in the second half, they'll have too much for Bolton. Yeah. I'm going for 2-0. I reckon Nolan will get on the score sheet today. Yeah, nice. Well, enjoy the game. Thanks a lot, mate.
so I'm here with Basti and Ty, two Ipswich Town fans. What did you make of that game? Just drew nil nil to Bolton. It's alright, we're just lacking in the finish. We're playing nice football. Yeah, we just need to work on areas, man. I like the focus. Obviously, Birmingham next Saturday. Are you boys going? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. And do you reckon we'll do it against Birmingham? Yes. With my dad. What do you make of that, dad? Um, didn't see any bit. Weren't really, didn't really test their goalie much. What do I think about today? Bolton, well, when they went down to 10 men, we didn't really take advantage of it. We didn't really test their goalie, so I don't know. Hopefully, I thought we were going to get a win today, but that's not happened. Birmingham next Saturday, they beat Leeds today. Do you reckon we'll do it against Birmingham or not? It doesn't look, I don't think so. What do you reckon the score will be? Do you reckon we'll lose? I hope not. I hope to like to, I like to see us get a win, but I can't see it at the moment. But hopefully I'm wrong. Hopefully we'll get hopefully we'll get a win, but I can't see it. What about you, Alex? What's your um? um what do you think of today's match? Ah, <clears throat> uh, well, first half, pretty similar to Brentford. We were pretty poor, giving the ball away, making silly errors. Second half, once again, we came back out and. I thought we were going to score in the second half. Their keeper made a very good save, um, but it wasn't meant to be. A draw is a draw. P potentially a fair result, although I think we should have won it in the second half. Just can't score, can we? No. Well, near, near the end of the game, <clears throat> I was getting frustrated because the goalie was passing along the ground. They were sort of passing along the ground. I thought, well, why can't the goalie just kick it up the pitch and you know get on their goal? Did you see that? Um, and they're like passing from the back. Yeah, their keeper made a, yeah. quite a few errors. So that was about I our think keeper. We... Gherkin was passing it from the back but on the ground. And near the end of the game, oh, I'd yeah, like to see this more, it up. Yeah, like get the goalie to kick it up near their goal and get mm. some pressure on them. But I, don't I know. think Walters is going to be out for a yeah. little while as well. I reckon he'll be out for six weeks. So Who's where's our old? goals coming from? Where are we going to... Jack, I think Jackson's going to bag a few Walt, goals. Walt, was he 34? Huh? He is 34, 30, isn't he? 35, actually. 34, 35. So it doesn't matter how old he is, he's lovely. Oh, it's all that matters. Just... Cheer well, up, Alex. Well, I'm cheered. <laughs> Welcome back, guys. I'm back in my garden. Just had a little chat with my dad about the game. You'll have seen that before this clip. Um, and, yeah. Nil, nil. We're still yet to win a game. And it's getting annoying. <laughs> um, anyway, our next game is against Birmingham next Saturday away. I don't actually know if I'm going to that yet. Um, who knows? We'll just see what happens. Uh, and so, yeah, uh, very disappointed. Nil nil. Could have potentially been a fair result, but the second half, we definitely should have scored. There was one point where I think it was Chambers who smashed a the header. Their keeper saved it. It was a brilliant save. But that's when I thought it was it. I thought we'd, I thought we'd done it. I thought we'd got our first win. Um, so yeah, obviously Johnny Walters is injured as well. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's not good, but I think it will pick up over time. And yeah, that is pretty much all I've got to say. Other than I don't know if you've seen, but my Brentford vlog, I did make a big announcement in that video, and some of you may not have seen that this season, myself. Um, this season, myself and Magical Vegas are going to be doing a collaboration during the whole season. So make sure you go over to Magical Vegas' Facebook site um, and leave their page a like because I'm going to be creating content for them to upload. And yeah, it's all good. Um, I've got a lot of big things to come. Alright, goodbye. Goodbye. Leave this video a like, subscribe. If you're new. And you know what to do. It really means a lot. <coughs>